So I will I will go and mix up my state reps and some that are for it and some opposed and I guess Representative Valancourt vocalizing and being a co-sponsor will call Representative Valancourt. Thank you, Mr. Chairman, members of the committee. For the record, my name is Steve Valancourt. I represent Manchester Ward 8, home of the Manchester Boston Regional Airport. I am here as a co-sponsor of this bill. I, in a sense, feel I have died and gone to legislative heaven because the first two speakers today really summed up my philosophy, Representative Murphy and Senator White. In fact, I sponsored this bill twice before in the House. And the reason I sponsored it the first time was because a constituent in Manchester called me and asked me to sponsor it. And this is just to say that elections have consequences. That constituent back then was Keith Murphy, who is now the prime sponsor of this bill as the duly elected representative from Bedford. When this bill was heard twice before, the Transportation Committee in the House didn't like it, but we almost overturned them on the House floor six years ago. This year, only one member of the Transportation Committee voted for it, but we overturned that committee by a tremendous margin on the House floor. It wasn't close, and it wasn't along party lines either. This is one of those rare things where Democrats and Republicans came together to realize you know, we really don't need something, and Senator White spoke of a compromise. This bill is a compromise. 30 states don't have inspections at all. So to go to every other year is, in fact, a compromise. We would like to cut taxes as Republicans and maybe as Democrats. We would really like to do that this year. The House budget proposes certain tax cuts if we can do them. We may not be able to do that, but in essence, this bill is a tax cut. A tax cut of at least $25 to $35, $40 every other year for somebody. Because by going to that inspection station every year, we're paying that much to have it inspected. But it's also a savings of my time as a human being. Probably two hours by the time it takes me to get there and wait and get home. So this, in a sense, is telling the people that we care for you. We may not be able to cut your taxes. We they may not be able to reduce that rooms and meals tax. We hope to reduce that registration on your car <coughs> surcharge. But we are concerned about you enough to say that we can do something for you. And this bill does something for you, money-wise and time-wise, without jeopardizing anybody's safety. We heard in the House tremendous testimony that while New Hampshire is a fairly safe state, New Jersey, which has every other year inspections, is safer than we are. So there is no correlation between safety and this. If there were, we wouldn't be pushing for it. When Representative Murphy first asked me to sponsor this, I thought to myself, you know, this not, may not go over very well in the House. But then when I found Myla Padden in research coming up with the fact that 30 other states don't have it at all, I said, we should be home free with this. So maybe after six years of trying, we will be home free. We're halfway there, and I hope you can push us over the finish line. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Are there any questions? No. Seeing none, thank you very much. Keith Carlson, in favor, wishing to speak? Yes.